One of the most common drugs to fight blood cancer, multiple myeloma, causes patients' platelets to decrease. Low platelet count means delaying treatment or lower doses of the drug, which is bad news for a lot of patients. But now there's a new way to keep that from happening. Lizzie Smith learned she has multiple myeloma during a routine blood test in 2012. So when a doctor tells you you have cancer, I can't think of really anything more dreaded than that. Lizzie got chemo, stem cell transplants, and bortezomib. It put her disease in remission, but depleted her platelet count and her blood's clotting ability. I felt like I was fading away, that I was maybe just kind of phasing into death, and I was so fatigued that I didn't really care. What's old is new again. Dr. Dean Lee found that in mice, Fusadil kept platelet counts normal. Vesadil is used in other countries for constricted arteries. We're not coming up with a new drug to treat the side effect of this cancer drug. We're trying to repurpose known drugs to treat this side effect. Lizzie's doctor says the findings give her hope. Absolutely, and hope is a very powerful thing. It gives us strength to keep fighting. Now Dr. Lee is searching for an FDA-approved compound like Vesadil, hoping to get similar results.